What has the new defense been like, and what, what are some maybe changes that you've noticed with your position? It's honestly, it's been a lot of fun. You know, the whole new coaching staff, it's been a lot of fun. They challenge us because they know that we're smart kids. They challenge us to really take, to really understand why we run the scheme, why we do those little things in each coverage. So it's been a challenge, but it's a fun challenge, I would say. It's a fun challenge for me and my group, especially because we got to do a lot of thinking on the back end. So it's been real fun, real fun, I would say. <clears throat> Coach just mentioned about how coming into camp he wanted you to maybe work on your tackling and he saw you know a big improvement. What did you do to get into that position? Really just critiquing myself. I'm, I'm really a, I'm a player that likes to critique himself in the little things that I do. So really when, once Coach Key and my position coach brought it to me that I needed to improve on that. So I really took that as a personal challenge with my, within myself to really just step up and just really just continue to make those plays and make those tackles that I've been making since I was a freshman, since I came here. So just trying to continue to have that, have that stable, stable mindset, just making those plays. I know it was just hired just a little bit ago, but what's, what's it been like building your relationship with Coach People so far? It's been fun, even though he came from right down the street from the other school. It's been, it's been real fun. He, he really challenges us like with the little details, just like just getting the fo uh, football alignment at all times because he always says, if you don't, you're going to get beat. So it's just him bringing him in has really challenged us as a position group to really harness and hone in on the little details that we may have not seen at first. So, but he points those little details out to us, and that makes us want to harp on those as well. How's the helmet comms kind of changed how things are flowing in terms of when you guys scrimmage or like the flow of play calling and those kinds of things? Have you noticed a difference? Not really. We we flow pretty well because all of us, uh, our whole defense, we've been we have a year under our under our belt playing together. So it's it's really it's really smooth. I would say we know we know how we can communicate with each other. We always check with each other after plays, pre snap, post snap, just to point out little things that they that may not have seen. But when we talk about it, it's a lot easier and we're able to flow and just keep on playing ball. Patrick. Do you uh, have a preference that uh, Coach Peoples mentioned a minute ago? He wanted you and Lamalus to each learn both safety positions. I just wondered if you have a preference on that or, or if it's any oh, consequence to you. Me, me and Lamalus, we take pride in that. We always say the more versatile you are, the more money you'll make. <laughs> so, we, yeah, so we always try to harness in on learning really all the, all the positions in the back end because if you know what you got and what somebody else got, you can also help, help another brother out within the play call. Time for one or two more for Clayton. We're all done. Okay. Thanks, Clayton. Thank Appreciate you. you. Yes, sir.